Hello and welcome back to another episode and yes this episode has a webcam in it because I decided to do it with a webcam why is okay thanks that's just <clears throat> Right, that won't happen again. Okay, that's not where I left off, but okay. I think it's time to do this mission. I, I swear I didn't have this gun. I didn't. Okay. Okay, I didn't, but okay. I don't know how long this is going to be. Hopefully it's less than an hour because... I don't think you should just be wandering around here, friend. Not a thing happens around here without an O'Driscoll saying so. Understand me? Consider this a warning. Careful, big man. Um, he took my weapon off me. Nothing to see here. Oh, I don't want to pick you up. I want my gun. Where's my gun? Uh huh. No, that's an old Dristol. Alright, give me my hat back. Okay. Oh my god, I was doing the right one. Right, let me just check this body. Or loot, I should say. Okay. 
I'm going to put my uh, lights at 50 because they are killing my eyes and I can't really see the game. Oh, there's a train. Yeah. Okay. And we went the wrong way. How the hell did we go the wrong way? God, didn't realize I was there. Oh wow, we're already in town. How are we going around back? He's a pussy cat. That's all worth her. Whatever you say. How much you cost, anyway? Well, ain't that a nice way to talk to a lady? Oh, I didn't know I was talking to a lady. Excuse me. Well, I must say, you got a fine way with the women, amigo. Yeah, regular dandy and a charmer. <laughs> Where's Bill? Oh, man. I dread to think about it. Hey, hey, hey. There he is. Watch where you're going. Are you about to kiss that guy a bunch? Oh, and we have our No, I prefer to stand here and watch. Uh-oh. Yeah. 
got this son of a bitch. Yeah. Come on. I ain't even started. Yeah. Kill him, Tommy. Why? Yeah, punch him in the nuts. Or kick him in the nuts. Sir, you won the fight already. Surely that's enough. What business is it of yours? <laughs> no business. <clears throat> no business, sir. But please, I beg you. Making new friends again. The detail on this is amazing. Like he's dirty because it rained. And I see Arthur. Look who we found sniffing about. Josiah Trelawney. The very same. <laughs> well, I thought you'd gone to New York. And miss all this glamour. You must be joking. How are you? Well, quite well indeed. I went to Blackwater looking for you gentlemen. You're not very popular there, it seems. I mean, that's where we came from. Ah, Javier and Charles. I've missed you. And Bill looking as well as can be. <laughs> Gentlemen, always a pleasure. You're right. We ain't too popular in Blackwater. We left a lot of money there. And young Sean, it seems. Sean, you found him? Yes, I have. He's being held by some bounty hunters, trying to see how much money the government will pay them. I know he's in Blackwater, but there's talk of them moving. Well, if we step foot in Blackwater, uh, ah, well, then we're dead men for sure. There'll be Pinkertons all over the place, but if he's alive, we gotta try. Yeah, of course. It's you they want, Dutch. Always is. Charles, go find out what you can, carefully. Josiah, take Javier. Arthur, go get yourself cleaned up. Join them when you're ready. Well, what about me? Well, exactly. What about you? <laughs> what does that mean? Oh, Bill, come on. That's something Trevor would do. Just find the nearest water hole and then just clean his face. Right. I want to loot these people. I can only pick up my hat. Fine then. Now, how do I get my horse? Oh, okay. So I'll just get myself stuck. Oh, there we go. F you, my dude.
Right, okay, let's go. Right, he told me just to get cleaned up, so I'm guessing I have to go back to camp. Okay, I'll we'll speak to him. You want to start something? I'll go away. I haven't done this in a while. Um, play Red Red Dead Redemption 2. I think he's um tired. Yeah. Is that a camp there? Maybe not. It says we just need to talk to him. Who goes there? It's me. Look who's back. Just let him know it's me. So we're getting Why used to the hunting? buttons. What are you hunting? An elephant? <laughs> I wish. No. I saw a huge bear. One of the biggest I ever saw. I reckon nearly a thousand pounds. My God. But you need me to come with you. Of course. Let's go. Where are we heading exactly? Up near the Dakota River. Might take a day or two. I could do with a break from this place. Oh, me too. It's been a rough couple of weeks. You need anything? I don't think so. I got all I need. Let's go then. So you still ain't replaced Bodicea? Nah, I miss her. She was quite a horse. This one's okay, but ain't no Bodicea. I've been meaning to offload this big Shire horse for a while now, unruly bastard. Where'd you get him? Some big, loudmouth bastard tried to rob me and was out riding, so I... Well, you know how it is. I see. Let's take him to Valentine. It's on the way. Sort of. There's a decent dealer there. We'll unload him. You could buy yourself a new horse. Put your saddle on them. Let's get going. Okay. But well, I do kind of like this horse. There's nothing wrong with two horses. And the stables always have the best ones. Well, I guess you're right. Just let me get this off, boy. This is going to be fun, Arthur. He won't throw me? No, he's an angel. If I'm near him. Nasty little look in his eyes. Oh, don't be rude about this magnificent creature. Okay, see if you can get your leg over that brute. Easy, big fella. All right, let's head into town. No bar fights, please. I heard about that. I'll do my best. We're heading out. Might be gone a couple of days. Fuck's sake. They 
got a good range of horse tack at the Valentine stables. Some beautiful saddles. I used to have a real nice one. Yeah, what happened to that? Got stolen outside that saloon in Deer Creek. Ah, uh, I remember now. Just about. Do, do. Uh, that turned into a long day. I don't remember. Yes. Remember? Mac went crazy. Threatened to kill the whole town. <laughs> and Davy was passed out so cold we left him there. Came back in the next day and he woke up started right back drinking again. <laughs> <laughs> Did he? Uh, I'll miss those boys. Jenny, too. She had some spark, that girl. It must be pretty hard on Lenny. You could tell he was sweet on her. Well, Lenny and Jenny could never have worked. That's like Arthur and Martha, or Bill and Phil. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe you're right. Does feel a bit like our luck died with them, too. Nonsense. We'll be all right. Just need some money to get back on our feet. I hope so. You found a way to offload those Cornwall bonds yet? Not yet. They're still very hot. Need to be done right. I have a couple of leads I'm looking into. Oh, okay. We're going off-roading. <laughs> Don't let that big bastard get the better of you there, Arthur. Hey, he's all right. Just up ahead. Huh? Feels like we were just here. All right. Go sell that big fruit. Buy yourself a horse. Okay. I'm going off to the general store. Get a few things to lure that bear out with. Meet you back here in a bit. Hey. How can I help you? I'm in the market for a new horse. Something strong and fast. Yeah, well, you're in the right place. I got some beauties in at the moment. <laughs> yeah. yeah. What about this one here? Yeah, are you looking to sell? I show you. You got papers? No. No papers. Well, of course, that's going to affect what I can pay. But your luck's in. I got a fella who's been looking for a decent workhorse like this for a while. You'll pay a good price. Otherwise, I can always stable them here for you. Here, take a look. Then I can ride a Dutch, or I can I can say I'm riding Dutch. I'm just getting rid of the stars. Just like in GTA Five. I just want like a basic one, I don't care. Thanks.
spook that thing and it tore around the damn stable. Here. All right, partner. You got yourself a deal. And a fine new horse. I hope so. Well, I don't sell anything other than good animals. You have my word on that. Here are your papers. And on me, a new grooming brush. And some treats. <laughs> Appreciate it. Yeah. All right, you. You treat this fella well. I know he's gonna look after you just fine. Are you sure about that thing? Interesting choice. How much did you pay for that thing? Not that much. Okay, well, with some good care, you should be able to make something of it. Are you going to mount that new horse of yours or not? No. Hop on up there. Let's go. All right. Let's get going. We've got quite a ride ahead of us. Lead the way. So, what's this lake we're heading for? It's called O'Cray's Run. Up in the mountains east of Cumberland Falls. I just hope I can remember how to get there. Back into the mountains? I sure didn't figure on that. But this time, we're doing the chasing. So how are things with you and John? Fine. Ain't it about time you let it go now? It was a year, Jose. He ditched us for a goddamn year. I've spoken to him many times. He knows he did wrong. He just wants to put it behind him. I'm sure he does. Running off on that kid is one thing, but there's code. He knows that. He ain't Trelawney. Dutch and you pretty much raised him. I know. But it's done. Has been for a while now. Nobody else would have been welcomed back that easy after that long. And you know it. Maybe. But please don't you put that to the test. Uh, I never would. Okay, I think we need to head right up here. Yes, I remember this place, Moonstone Pond. We're going the right way. Okay, but that, that doesn't help anything. That's the lake there. Good. We made it. Let's loop around the other side. <sighs> I should really be heading back over to Great Plains, see about Sean. It's bounty hunters who've got him? So Trelawney says. Javier and Charles have gone with him to scope it out. Pretty dangerous going anywhere near Blackwater. Right, but if he's alive, we gotta try. Of course. <gasps> Look there. Rabbits. Maybe we should catch one to cook. Sure. Try and shoot one. You don't want to use anything too powerful on a small animal like that. Just ruin the meat. Best thing's a bow or a 22 caliber varmint rifle. I have hunted rabbits before, you know. Yes, and obliterated them with a shotgun, if I remember right. <laughs> Excuse me.
Oh, come on. There we go. Wait. Oh, there it is. Good job. All right. It's getting late. Wreck we should camp here. Sure. You get it set up. Okay, that's not actually where I wanted to put it. Uh, I'm famished. Cook that rabbit, then. They're delicious on an open fire like this. Fine by me. <gasps> okay, this is where I'm going to leave today's episode. Because, for one, I didn't actually realise it was going to be this long. And I am tired. As it's very late, and I really want to go to bed as well. So, thank you for watching, and I hope to catch you on my next episode. I don't know when that's going to be because at the moment I am quite busy on the weekdays, which is quite funny because that's when I upload. But it's called YouTube for a reason. Uh, make sure you, if you're new around here, make sure you subscribe. And if you enjoyed, make sure you hit the like button. My name is Stickleberry, and I'll catch you on the next one.